As a young boy, I always was singing. I was always drawn to, to the church. I was drawn to the church music and the sounds of the organs in the Catholic church then. And so I was cantering at age 13, I believe, is when I started cantering every weekend, uh, one or two masses a weekend. The real beauty came in when you start taking it to worship. And it goes no longer from being a performance, but being worship. And that was where the real beauty came in, the words of the songs and, and the responsorial songs. And uh, that's what really what drew me in, in, into the Catholic Church, into the music. And it was great fun, amazing. Um, and I got actually caught away from the church for a while, got away from the Catholic Church for a while because uh, it became too much of performance and it wasn't uh, worshiping and I wasn't feeling gratified personally. It was nice having people say, oh, that was beautiful, nice job. It was really nice and, 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 and to hear those things and it was very humbling to hear those things, but it wasn't getting to the core of really what was happening on the altar, the core of really what the experience of the Mass was. And so I, I, I stopped for a little while. So that got me a little piqued about the, the restaurant industry, the, the business world. And so at some point after working there for a year, year and a half, I was just about finished with my graduate studies. And with $1,000 and uh, another friend of mine, we opened up a, a, a cafe. And next thing you know, I, I started opening up more and more stores and got involved in the business world. And then I started developing more stores and then broke off on my own and started buying more real estate. You know, next thing you know, I have this, um, for me, a fairly large portfolio of commercial buildings as well as uh, restaurants, uh, different concepts. And so that was an interesting mix. And what happened was um, through these buildings, uh, sometimes uh, tenants would leave it and there were bars that were in some of these buildings. And next thing you know, I'm not just in the restaurant business, I'm in the bar business in a college market. And you start seeing those things, they start getting to your soul. Things. I went through a, a really interesting business transition where I was flying really high, doing uh, interesting things in business, but my soul wasn't being fulfilled. And, um, and then the real estate market started to take a hit in Indiana. And I tell you, it's such an uh, amazing experience when you get fear out of your life. How much freer you are, how much more open you are, how much more real you can be. And so then I started looking at my life as ministry, as opposed to business, as opposed to secular ways. Yeah. But that's the full leap there is if you, if you give up and say, God, I'm ready. Is this what you want? I'm ready. And that's what happened. And now we're here in Islands Ranch and could not be happy. Yeah.